my beloved people in christ god's limitless grace has been upholding us so far and his mercy is never end my beloved people our god is always a god of love and he is not a god of far but he is always with you he resides into you and he is your god praise be to god every day with holy spirit named a short message today it is going to be a very blessed one and it will bring forth blessings let's go to the word acts chapter 6 and verses 10 and they were not able to resist the wisdom and the spirit by which he spake who is the person stephen who is stephen he comes only in this 6th chapter in the early church there was a small argument in serving food immediately the elders of the church get together and they select seven people for serving food and one of the person was stephen he was a person who serves food but he may do that job but in a personal way he was a person who had a close relationship with god he had anointing upon him he was full of grace and when he started to speak there was no one who could stand against him even today if someone say they are the people who are speaking against me i am unable to overcome this problem i am unable to struggle with this situation i am unable to overcome this struggle is there any problem like that i tell you be bold secondly don't lose your heart thirdly be filled in the spirit and pray you may be a ordinary person in the others people's sight you may be a very insignificant person but god tells you a word that they will not be able to stand against the spirit which is in you amen praise be to god so no one can stand against you such a great eloquency god will give you people will hear your word amen what brother is saying let's do that don't be afraid depend on the anointing god will fill you so much of power in your words that no one can stand against you you will overcome your problems okay be bold will pray will all together will pray lift up your hands and pray our loving father thank you for this blessed time lord we have meditated from acts 6 verses 10 we just cling to that word have mercy on your children lord have mercy on your children have mercy on your children lord help them father i will lift up my eyes unto the hill from where my help comes from as david said we just lift up our eyes towards you as they have received the anointing fill them more with your anointing and fill them with your new strength as samson had that strength nobody was able to stand against him david had that strength and he was conquering all the wars against him more than that lord jesus because you were filled in the spirit no enemy was able to stand against you lord lord i pray for the people for their blessing for their work for their job for their studies for their education for their needs lord i pray for every of their needs lord let them be changed that nobody can stand against them let everything come before them and bow before them because of the anointing lord let them overcome everything in a very easy way let your fire fall upon them anointing surround them lord thank you jesus Thank you for hearing our prayers in the name of Jesus I pray amen my beloved people you can share this message to many people all the people who are hearing in english 
you can share to all of your friends relatives let everyone be blessed god wills we will meet you again god bless you our address jesus meets ministries number 4 kavarapalayam main road avadi chennai 54 india telephone number 9841252836 7299546363 email id gpsrobinson@hotmail.com gps.office@jesusmeets.org website address www.gpsrobinson.org